Hi, welcome. This is Gigi, and this is a collective tell reading for all signs. And so it's a general reading, you guys. General, okay. I recommend you go ahead and watch my uh, past readings. I've been told many times that my reading resonate weeks, sometimes months, and I'm pretty sure there's some gift for you in the December 2020 tower reading, okay? So this is for all signs. It's a collective energy reading, okay? I wanted to thank you all, to all my subscribers who have subscribed to my channel the last few days. Thank you for my subscribers that have been with me for a while. I'm so humble and thankful for you guys. I love you very much, okay? So let's not waste any time and see what the message is collective, okay? Collective reading, timeless reading. Seven of, of Wands, Seven of Wands, same thing. Ten of Pentacles. Four of Cups, Judgment, Eight of Pentacles, and Strength card. I've seen this in the inner reading. You know, in everything in life, we have losers and we have winners. That's what I see here. With the Seven of Rods, Seven of Wands is in a reverse, okay? So I feel that there's a giving up. Okay, uh, someone is admitting defeat, being defeated. Okay, um, looking at the judgment here, this is this most important energy because it's it's reinstalling someone good reputation or something about a good reputation after because that's what it is. Judgment is we being judged. Okay, after some things that happened that we didn't see, there's some you know, spirit coming out or things that we were not aware, then we restore order, okay? That's the karmic order. That's the spiritual order. The, that order that we can't control, that we don't know when it's coming, when it's, where it's going, what it's going to do, how much of an impact it's going to have, but it's there. It's coming out, okay? Because I was saying earlier, there's a winner and there's always a loser, okay? That's going to be maybe this energy going on, okay? Someone's going to win and someone is not going to win. Someone's going to lose, right? Or I should say, you know, if you didn't win, you're going to learn something. We're going to learn something today for sure. With the Ten of Pentacles, it's like finally uh, re restoring uh, family balance in some areas of life, re recover recovering what we have lost in terms of, it could be a reputation, in terms of, uh, you know, um, some type of conflict or dispute, we're restoring the balance. That's what the judgment says. We're restoring something that is uh, secure and stable, okay, with the ten, ten of Pentacles. It could be in your family too. Maybe there was some something that was dragging for a while, uh, and then good or bad, right? Yes or wrong, because it, it may not, you know, it may not satisfy everybody, but the good thing is with the judgment now, we're using our discernment. Things are out, okay? So it's a decision that goes beyond boundaries, which mean it's going to stay. It's stable, okay? All right, so there's also a miracle here. There's something about a miracle about this winning or this being defeated, okay? Whoever, whatever has been defeated there's a miracle, okay? Maybe it wasn't, it was going in a certain direction and it switched, all right? And the reason why it switched is due to the karmic celestial energy, which is more powerful than any justice on earth, okay? That's what it is. And it also says, it says, when it's good, it's good. Doing the right thing, that's how you get the judgment in your favor, okay? As you go with the most uh, the most positive celestial energy, and that's how the most high always support those that goes towards that line, regardless of what other people think, all right? We cannot agree with everybody, just like everybody cannot like us. It's the way it is. Ten of Pentacles, the most important thing is, is the recovery of stability, recovery of health. I think that health is coming back now, okay? Uh, we're going to find ways 
or maybe there was some family members that were struggling with their health. It could be they were struggling with money or something was taken away. And due to this winning, there's more money coming here. But it's looking at the Eight of Pentacles in a reverse, which is also uh, losing motivation. Okay, what is that? Why is someone losing motivation? Because again, it goes back to what I was saying. There's winners and there's losers. So now the people that are, may not get what they wanted or things did not go with how they wanted, now they are losing motivation. All right, as they don't want to put work forward. They don't have the strength. Strength is in a reverse. Maybe they don't have the influence. And the reason why they don't have the strength or they feel they don't have uh, what it takes to move forward or they're not willing to uh, put work into going for it is because of the judgment came out. And that is, like I said, that's the ultimate judgment. That's where everything stopped. It, it cannot be continued, this, this conflict, this disagreement, this dispute, because someone has been defeated by the court of the most high, the judgment. All right? So... It could come out many ways in your life. You guys let me know. You comment and let me know how you have observed that to be true, that there's a defeat. And due to the defeat, you could see that there's some group of people, some people, maybe yourself, someone else, who's not putting the work now into their future. They're not, they're, they're, they have lost uh, motivation. There's some energy of frustration. Okay, someone feels frustrated, maybe more than one person because of the decision that is now, um, that is uh, final. That's a final decision. That's what judgment says. It's a final decision. There's a final decision in some type of an issue here. Okay, strength card is in a reverse. That could, has to do with the government, right? Because whenever I see the strength card, it represents Leo. And Leo is, is like in the astrological belt, it does represent the government. Okay? All right? So it could be something that uh, uh, maybe the government has a problem to accept. Someone has an issue accepting something about the government here. Four of Cups is in this position here. Okay? So Four of Cups in this position, it's always about being dissatisfied. Okay? um tired definitely this energy is but i feel like it's due to this covid and do don't do this and don't do that and some people are not going back to school and as much as they're trying to fight and and really they're really just the judgment says you know there's something taking place that it's stronger than us the individual in question okay and the strength card that could say that um the strength card in a reverse that could say that you know the this this unsupportive energy and it's a strong unsupportive energy that cannot really just simply be ignored because the strength card is very powerful even in a reverse four of cups people are not agreeing they're not really they're dissatisfied it could be because also of this balsamic moon. Okay, I think it's today or tomorrow. The devil. Ugh. Six of pentacles is in a reverse. And page of cups in a reverse. So um, some people are not happy with the situation for the kids. That has to do with the kids. Kids not really. Kids are a concern now. All right. So the devil came out. Imagine this devil energy all right so what we know about the devil the devil is about negative energy it's also it's it relates to addiction okay it has to do about an influential person okay so especially when it comes in this position it's about an influential person a, an idol but the bottom line is a narcissist you can never be a nice, but you cannot look at the devil with someone who compassion and has empathy. No, that doesn't work. The devil says, okay, it's a narcissist. So now we know that the narcissist has been defeated, right? Because it's standing next to the seven of rods, which is, uh, you know, this energy of, you know, just trying to 
being defeated actually <laughs> straight up like that it's like being defeated okay the seven of rod is about this narcissist is being defeated all right it's about um this nice narcissist is not wanting to move on okay okay it's in a reversal there's also i feel like there's a brutal arrival Woo! something's gonna change course right here seven of wands next to the devil okay Someone wants to change something, okay? Because like I said, this devil energy here, looking at the seven of rods, he's not, he's like, he, he doesn't want to give up. He has to give up. It's in a reverse. It, this, this is about giving up in a reverse. It's about being defeated. He doesn't want, the narcissist doesn't want to be defeated. Looking at the six of pentacles here, I feel like there's like, there's definitely someone who's lacking humility here. Okay. And it's about what they're about to lose. Okay. Because six of pentacles in the reverse is, is really, it's being on your guard, lacking humility. In this position, it's all about donation. Right. And sharing. And the reverse is no, 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 no. I'm not sharing this. I'm not sharing my position, whatever that ten of pentacles is. Some, that's how they feel. They don't want to lose money. It's all about money. Money is a big deal here. Now we have a page of cups here looking at the four of cups. All right. So this dissatisfaction is related to um, a new beginning. Okay. Someone doesn't want a new beginning for a child or a new beginning for something. Someone doesn't want that to happen. All right. They, they're dissatisfied. They're not happy. All right. Tired. Don't want to invest. Let's continue. Two of, of wands in a reverse. The full. And the seven of cups in a reverse. Wow. So now we get to the bottom of this with the two of wands in a reverse. Okay, so this is about uh, lacking of initiative, all right? It's also a fear of the unknown. We really have, there's a new beginning for all of us, my collective. Judgment says so. And with that, you know, some of, some people do, looks like there's a fear of the unknown. Two of rods is in a reverse. In this position, it's about planning you know, having a reflection of going forward. It's this position is like, mm, fear, lack of initiative. What is going on? All right. That's good. That's why we, that's the fool. Okay. Checkmate. Whenever I see this card, that's what it tells me. Checkmate. So we're finding excuses. All right. With the eight of pentacles, finding an excuses about fr our frustration about a lack of motivation so we find we're finding an excuse here not to work into a new beginning not to just start new not to just follow what the karmic celestial energy says some of us are finding excuses not to work towards something and the seven of of cups in a reverse for me it's always a uh, clarity of a decision Okay, clarity of a decision. It's in a reverse. Things are there. Some a lot of things that are happening individually and collectively. Where it seems that like there's like a division here. I, I hope it's it's in the past and it's ending now that it's coming in. But looking forward, someone is really dissatisfied. They're not they don't want to give um chance to a beginning with the four cups. And the in the in the four cups and the page of cups in the reverse, someone doesn't want to give a chance to a new beginning. They're tired. They don't want to invest anymore. Emotionally, they don't want to believe in something better that something could be better. They don't want to believe that. And the seven of cups here, in the reverse, is it really is. You know clarity of a decision okay so 
strength card now I, I i get the sense that there's really a, a changing of the guards here and people are not happy okay because i feel like there's other people that's going to get to their abundance now there's other people that's going to get to their abundance definitely all right that's when the timing says that with the judgment it's about that but i'm going to end this reading here for you my collective just let me know how this resonated with you. Let me know what is going on. Like I said, those are general reading. You don't have to be a participant. You could observe this around you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave. Like and share my video. And until next time, send you lots of kisses. I love you.